I'm Terry Pilkadaris. And I'm Rory here. In this episode, we're going to show you how to hit it high. We'll break it down into three key steps that if you combine, should help you to hit it high. Oh, need more power. Step one. Do it again. <laughs> we need to cut that one. He thinned it. <laughs> How to hit it high. Many times on the golf course, you need to hit the high shot. Obviously in certain conditions, when the greens are really firm, or the pins just over a bunker, yeah. you want to launch the ball high. Yeah, for me, when I hit wayward, wayward shots off the tee, I need to get it up above a, some trees. That's one of my favorite shots to hit. Okay, I don't hit it in the trees, so I'm all right with that. <laughs> Step one, ball forward. So in order to hit the ball up in the air, you've got to have the ball forward of your stance. So that's your normal standard position, this Rory. This is my standard position. So when I'm going to hit it high, I'll roll it up a little bit, about one ball in front. So what this does is that actually throws my weight distribution more right of the golf ball and also adds more loft to it. Step two, head behind the ball. We've got to make sure the head is slightly behind the ball. This will allow you to get the club going up and releasing better. When you're setting up to this, you want to hit it higher. What are you doing with your head position? So I'm going to tilt my head more to the right to allow my spine to bend away from the target. When I put the ball up a little bit, it automatically throws my head more to the right of the golf ball, which helps me uh, which helps bend my spine away from the ball, which will then allow me to release a little bit earlier. I'm gonna allow my right hand to come under my left hand a little bit more past impact, so that adds more loft to it. So by moving the ball further forward, this puts his head behind the ball, which will make it easier for him to release the club. Step three, releasing the club. Now obviously, you've got to release the club to get the ball up in the air. It's very different to the shot where you're trying to hit the stinger and the handle leading forward. Actually, the club head has almost got to feel as though it's passing the hands. Rory, what do you do to feel as though it releases the club? So for me, for my normal golf shots, I want my left hand to lead, but for this special shot, I want to feel like my right hand goes under my left hand on the follow through in this manner. So that, what that does is it actually throws the loft up a little bit more, which sends the ball up way higher than normal. Just got to recap on the high shots. Ball forward, head behind the ball, and releasing the club. All right, Roy, let's see your best high shot. Let's see it. I can do better than that. Very high. Thanks for watching the video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Comments below. Don't forget to click on the Asian Troll logo to subscribe and click on the link for another video.